Praise God, praise God. Well, as promised, I told you I was going to bring to you none other than the founder, the CEO, the brainchild behind the Urban Inspirational Awards, and here he is, none other than Corey, a.k.a. Hood McClure. Man, oh, all hail to the king that is from the king of kings. That's right. That was, it has just been phenomenal yes. for the 2011 Urban Inspiration Awards. You've got to feel good. I do. Yeah. It was definitely a good feeling. Uh, a lot of good artists. Yes. A lot of good energy. Oh. Uh, man, you could have been crunk all night. It's so. been hot. And the praises so definitely went up. Oh, man. Look, we sit back here like, okay, some cameras. We have to run out and look and see what's <laughs> going on. I'm telling you, this is phenomenal. Yeah. Had a great opportunity to talk with the majority mm -hmm. of the artists that were here. They have nothing but praise to say about the event. Right. They were blessed. Um, we heard words like it was awesome, you know, oh, thank God for this. And yeah. lots of people thankful to you for uh, actually stepping out on faith mm -hmm. and, and making sure that this happens for them every right. year. So I want to make sure that everybody understands where this birth from. So let's talk a little bit about the history okay. of Urban Inspiration Awards. Well, um, it started off five years ago. We started off as the Carolina's Holy Hip Hop Achievement Awards, okay. and it was a hip hop show. Um, we were going around just getting all the hip-hop artists together from North and South Carolina, but a lot of people from across the nation signed up. And then, you know, kind of got convicted after, after the first two years. It was like, hey, you know what? If we're going to call this kingdom music, we got to go out and represent the kingdom, but it can't just be hip-hop. That's right. So we went out to rock, contemporary. We went out to uh, rhythm and praise, mm -hmm. uh, hip-hop. We went out to everybody and said, hey, let's bring it together. And let's glorify the kingdom. So this is our fifth year, and um, we... We're pretty well rounded this year. Oh, with the absolutely. So, um, yeah. Absolutely. So here we are. I know that because I uh, had an opportunity to sit down and interview you on some of the mm -hmm. networks coming into the Urban Inspirational World. Right, and right. you were talking about how it was a little difficult to get the rock groups and oh, things yeah. like that to come on board right. um, for reasons that they felt maybe the black church or whatever right. wouldn't appreciate them right. exactly. or they didn't really fit into these types of awards. Uh -huh. But I saw, I know one group, I think you had two, two, two uh, rock groups here. True Witness and yeah. Three Nail Testimony. Now we didn't get a chance to, I don't, we didn't get to do a second interview to really mm -hmm. get in depth with Three Nail. Right. But we got in depth with True uh, Witness. Uh -huh. Phenomenal. Oh, yeah. And got a chance to witness their ministry, man, yeah. that was hot. Yeah, I like yeah. it, I, I like yeah. it. I like and they it. are so genuine. Yes. Just pure in ministry. So, you know, kudos to you for Thank being persistent you. with that because a lot of people would have been, okay, well, they don't want to do it. Never mind. I tried. But right. I know you worked at it. Oh, and you, yeah. you talked to them. You ministered with them and said, hey, come on. Right. You'll be surprised how well you will be mm -hmm. embraced. Right. And I was standing in there watching your audience. Yeah. By the way, it was packed up in here. <laughs> mm -hmm. Watching your audience really getting into them oh, yeah. when they were up ministering. Oh, yeah. And uh, they, had, they had a good time. And, yeah. I mean, they, they really love ministering. And it's like, I mean, from the, I think the youngest person in the group had to be six, like 16. Right. And the oldest person in the group, this is a rock group, right. like 55 right. years old. I mean, come on. Yeah. And we talked about that when they, when they interviewed. It was like, yeah. you talk about diversity. You had the young, the old, I mean, just, you know what I'm saying? But they were all crunk and hyped yeah. and happy to be a part of ministering yeah. for the kingdom. Yeah. Beautiful, just beautiful. Well, where do you go from here, man of God? I mean... Um, we're trying to do it like, a lot bigger and better next year. We're getting all these sponsorships and stuff early, and um, we, we want to take it definitely to the next level. Of course uh, you I can't are. wait. Of course you wait. are. Lots yeah. of surprises. Yeah. So, uh, we ready. Well, you know, Praise Festival, we're going to put it on record right now. We are here for you. Whatever we can do uh, for, from the media aspect, the artistry or whatever, because uh -huh. we did put it out there to, you know, the Praise Fest tour. Right. And uh, we're proud parents on tonight because New Purpose did win their category. <laughs> you know? And I'm going to put it out there also because I want y'all to be the official media for the Urban Inspiration Awards. Wow. So I, I want y'all to the handle the media just like this year and um and be the ones controlling the media. All the yeah. media comes through. Praise Fest. Praise God. That's, how, that's how we want to do and it. Let me tell I have you, a good time. I count that an honor uh -huh. because you know we are God blessed us. It's new. This right. is a new aspect of our ministry. Mm -hmm. And for you to entrust us like that. We had a great time on tonight. And everybody that promised they would be here didn't even show up, but they missed their blessing. Yeah. 
they missed their blessing. The ones that were here, mm -hmm. I mean, to see all the cameras going off and your red carpet looks phenomenal. Thank you. you know what I'm Thank saying? You. And I am honored and very humbled and thankful that you're entrusting us with that. And I will, as long as there's breath in my body, you got it. We, we are here. We will do everything that we can to make sure that the look gets as big and as grand as God would have it. Mm -hmm. And whatever your heart's desire is, yes. we're standing in agreement with you. Thank you. Yes. And Thank so if he takes it to the biggest arena there is, we're going to be right there with you. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> and that's my word. Let's get it. Yes, let's do it. All right, so 2011 is done. We're getting ready to start preparing for 2012. You've uh, got to do it early. Got to do it early. You know, and start putting it out there. Let me say to you, the networking was phenomenal. I kind of watched, and we kind of was in the midst of things. Right. The artists were so pleased with your networking event that you had on well, they yesterday. They had a whole lot of fun with the speed, man. I mean, yes. At first, they were kind of, kind of, yeah, you know, it's like, new. hey, I don't, I, I, I don't different. know. We then, once you start passing out the sheets and they see everybody, you know, getting contact and yes. going, you know, doing it real quick and going to the next new person, then they start catching on, like, yes. hey, where's my sheet at? Where's right. my pen at? And they start getting, <laughs> getting involved. It was real cool. I had a chance to peek in at parts of it and New Purpose was. Kendaria was so excited. She's yeah, like, okay. I gotta go. I gotta get my names on my sheet, yeah, you know. Yeah. And I, I saw that and I said, okay, that is phenomenal right, right. there. So you definitely need to keep that because I, yeah. underst I understand where you're going with that. Yeah. Because you it's want, about networking that's and helping each other. That's why you break the ice right yes. off the beginning. Yes. You know, a lot of times we come out to these conventions and, you know, I'm from, I'm from Charlotte. Another artist might be from Charlotte. We might be in Atlanta. But because we're from Charlotte, we might hang together. Because we're from Charlotte, I might know. Let's break the ice. You don't know these cats across the room. We're both ministers. Mm -hmm. Go over there, see what they do with their ministry. And so, and just, you know, trade information. That's Let's right. keep on trading off and meeting new people and seeing what we can do for each other to help advance the kingdom. Well, as you're going back and watching the footage, you'll see a lot of them made reference to being mm -hmm. able to network right, right. one with the other. Right. So that is another aspect of the Urban Inspiration Awards. Let me tell you, right. no other award show does that. Right. You know, you have to go out and make it happen for yourself. That's no right. other award show actually includes a networking mixer. Right. So that people can network and get information and be a blessing to each other. That's right. So God is truly using you to do just what he's called you to do, which is to give independent gospel artists a chance That's right. out here. That's right. So man of God, I am godly proud of you. Thank you. You know, and excited that you are answering the call and going forth in purpose. I really am. And anything that we can do, you just know it's done. Thank it you. is done. Likewise. You know, um, want to do this in case there's anybody out there that wants to be a volunteer uh -huh. or they may want to be an, uh, an artist that wants to. Let's get some contact information okay. so they'll know how to reach out to you. Okay. Um, you can reach out to me by email at urbaninspirationalawards at gmail.com or you can sign up on the website urbaninspirationalawards.com. Send me a personal message. Message once you get on there. I'm um, listed as Hood 704. Just sign up as a member if you if you're just like a regular fan or you know, just want to help us out or whatever. Mm -hmm. If you're an artist, sign up as an artist. Create three songs, a picture, a bio. You can also put up YouTube videos, mm -hmm. and that you can get in touch with us that way. Okay. Or you can call 980-428-9114. Again, it's 980-428-9114. All right, awesome. and one last thing before we go, you've got to talk about that magazine. Oh yeah, let me turn it around. Let's get a good shot of that. I tell you, Urban Inspirational is doing it big, y'all. <laughs> that is the new magazine from the Urban Inspirational Awards. Talk a little bit about that and how people can get it. Um, I designed the cover myself. Yeah, <laughs> beautiful. Yeah, thank you. And um, we're gonna we're gonna put this magazine online. We're gonna have an online version. We're gonna do it quarterly. Okay. We're going to have artists in it. We, um, along with the magazine, we're going to be doing like the mixtape and everything also. Uh, going along with the magazine just to build everything up to the, uh, to the Urban Inspirational Awards every year. Yes. So we're going to do it uh, quarterly. And once we get right up to around the time we get ready to, to do the awards again, we'll release that big magazine and we'll release that big mixtape that will lead right up to it. So we just want to keep building and building and building the excitement up to the event. There it is. You got it live. Up close and personal and exclusively from the Praise Fest Gospel Hour Show. I am your girl, Pastor T. It's been an honor and a pleasure to bring to you the 2011 Urban Inspirational Awards. 
Make sure you keep it locked for all of the updates about the awards and everything that Mr. Corey, a.k.a. Hood McClure, is doing in Charlotte, North Carolina. God bless you, and by all means, have a praise-filled day. <laughs>